Hey guys, in this video, we are going to take a look at the POSP Beta 9.0 for our Redmi Note 5 Pro. So, without wasting more time, let's start. So, this POSP, which is like called as the Potato Open Source Project, was introduced with Android Oreo, and now we have the POSP 9 Beta. And you can see Android version 9 and the POSP like Potato Wired. And you can see Android 9 with the latest December security batch. And you also have the POSP information here. You can see uh, baked. So this version is called baked. The previous was called Aligot, and now we have 2.1 version number and official. You can see the maintenance. So it's built with Jenkins. Uh, so this is like some information about the build that. As you can see, we get this Pixel launcher, the normal one, and with Google Feed. And you can see into the home settings, which is Pixel launcher settings. So it's actually the launcher, not the Pixel launcher. Like what the fuck? I'm using this ROM since like two days and i didn't even know the launcher so we have this launcher settings and i have made a different video on launcher so you can watch it and then you can see you have all the usb apps and into the settings we move into you have the customization tab which i'm going to take a look at then let's take a look at the things you can see with the display we had the tap to wake ambient display all the other normal stuff then into we have fingerprint face auto unlock and you can just enable that uh, by flashing nano gfs or higher then we have the digital well-being like every other rom has it now now let's go into the customization tab which is the main thing in here like what it was like almost normal stuff you can see we have this normal stuff in status bar the quick settings themes it's basically theming the system ui then the buttons and gestures then the notifications and the miscellaneous stuff it's just face auto unlock like which i told you already so this is just uh, like a beta rom so it's just actually in its beta stages and a lot of improvements and more additions will be made to the rom so i hope to see you guys soon with an official and like fully stable rom and you can see also it has the voltage icon from oss or maybe it's a usb normal icon i don't know but yeah it looks good like i like this voltage icon not the others normally like differentiated and really weird icons and uh, that's it nothing else uh, about the customizations it like for now it has just this thing as the performance is actually really smooth like the rom is really smooth like going good you can see and messages and emails the, everything is good like, everything is fine also pubg is able to play like i'm able to play pubg in high graphics and hd uh, hd graphics and full high mode fps and you can see it opens the apps really quickly and keeps it in memory so this is one thing i really good and these are many of the roms are doing a great work at but while gaming like we leaves a lot of batteries this thing should be fixed somewhere like a lot of battery drain is faced while gaming so let me tell you my battery stats um you can see here and i can see you can see pubg i have played for 2 hours and 45 minutes and that is the drain i faced while playing pubg so this was really bad so i had to charge it today again so i got about this by, uh, like pattern i got only five hours of screen on time and this i again charge it to 47 i got three hours so yeah battery is like uh, it's okay it's about to like i've been using it a day but like while playing games it drains a lot so maybe these things needed to be checked and will be fixed with the official and stable release so if you guys have liked this video press the like button if not the dislike button subscribe to my channel for more videos on the redmi note fabro and other devices and i'll see you guys in the next video till then bye bye